Hey hobby kids, we're gonna play Super Fight, the game of absurd arguments. It's where you get to make your own superhero and pick its powers and argue who would win in a fight. Let's get to battling. Here's how you play. There's a bunch of black cards, which are superpowers. Ooh. And there's a bunch of white cards that are superheroes, or people in history or famous characters. Pig is youngest, so he's going to take three cards from each pile first. Then Hobby Pig has to pick one superhero or one white card and one superpower, one black card. So I'm picking up three cards, but I only get to keep one. And I'm also picking up three black cards, but I only get to keep one as well. So I gotta see which one I want to keep. Now let's see what superhero Hobby Pig has. I am a ultimate fighting champion. Has a magical unicorn horn. Wow! Put your cards down. That's what you are. I have a cat. Ah! And I have x ray vision. What? You better watch out, Hobby Pig. I'm sure Hobby Pig's gonna win this one. Yeah, I have, I have a like, unicorn horn that can like, shrink your cat down and I'll stop him. That's true. Well, that's not the whole game. Now we both get to pick one more black card and we have to apply it to our character. Writing a... Now he has to pick a white card and apply it to that card. What is he writing? A dolphin. He's writing a dolphin! <laughs> okay. Now let's see what else my cat has. I have an invisibility cloak. Now that we know what we have exactly, me and Hobby Pig will argue over who would win in a battle. My cat with x-ray vision and an invisibility cloak, or his ultimate fighter riding a dolphin. And don't forget, he has a unicorn horn. <laughs> oh, please get something dumb. I have an invisibility cloak. I could I could use my I could use my magical horn to have so I can have x-ray vision, like I could do stuff. You could see me even though I have a, you know what? And you're riding a dolphin, they're pretty smart. So I'm, I'm thinking you do win. Good job, man. So Hobby Pig wins this battle. That's Round two. A robot. <laughs> a robot. Three stories tall. A three stories tall robot. That is pretty cool, but I might have you beat because I am a saber-toothed tiger and I shoot acid, which eats through metal robots. I might have you know. Okay, so pick one more from the black deck. Let's see what you have. Armed with a sadness ray. A sadness ray. All right, let me see what I have. I throw bears. <laughs> I throw actual bears. Okay, so you're three stories tall, but my acid, I shoot acid, and it's gonna make you shrink. When I shoot it, I, if I shoot it, I shoot my sadness ray with the acid. I'm a saber-toothed tiger. I'm three stories tall. So you're a three story tall robot, sure, but I'll shoot acid at your ankles and it makes you fall. I shoot with this boy band. You should have went with boy band. You could have had boy band. <laughs> you should have totally went with boy band. Um, and I'm throwing bears at you. I'm not really sure what that could do to a robot. You are a saber to to a tiger, and you don't know how to throw bears. Apparently, I do. That's what this card says. I throw bears. But he's always like, like on his arms and legs. It amazes me too. But I throw bears. Where are the bears coming from? <laughs> That's a good question. <laughs> we're in the forest when we're fighting, so there's bears and I throw them. No, we're in the city. They're city bears. <laughs> we're in New York. New York bears. <laughs> they're Chicago bears. <laughs> yeah, New York. Well, what for in Chicago when I'm throwing the bears? <laughs> mm, 
<laughs> They're football players. <laughs> well, they'll just be scared. I'll make them sad with my sadness ring. <laughs> oh, 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 but my acid still eats you. You're a robot. I shoot it with, I shoot my, like, sadness on with the acid. What would it do? Acid doesn't get sad. It's, it's already mad. If you make it sad, it might get madder and eat you more aggressively. Where, where are the bears coming from? <laughs> I can switch to the tiger because I'm so big. Now you win. That's good. Good job. So he won two, two out of three. Hobby Pig, you just are too good at this game. I'm doing round three with Hobby Dad. Oh, it's Hobby Mom! It's on my it's Donkey Kong. It's on like Hobby Mom! <laughs> so the rules say the youngest goes first. Go ahead, Hobby Mom. Why, thank you, Hobby Dad. No problem. I'll give you kisses later. It's all about the kisses. <laughs> I've got some culture funnies right here. So what I picked is a kindergarten class that used to be a bear. <laughs> <laughs> How does that help you? It makes no sense. So, so there's, have... there's, there's hobby kids in a, in a class. And they used to be a bear. Huh. Yeah. Not, not sure how that helps you. I, you should have seen what I had. Yeah. <laughs> this is what I had to work with. I would have went with Claw. Your mom or an angel. My mom, she's... Tiny T-Rex arms and clothes that are too tight. <laughs> yeah. So I didn't have much. I've got Forrest Gump and I control an army oh, of great. flying monkeys. Oh, guess what? <laughs> guess what? Kindergarten class of kids. We're, we're dead. I don't know. They used to be bears. Don't count them out. What's nice about this game is this black pile right here could change the whole thing. Like it could turn me into paper. Oh, like, I we, might be a paper guy. Are we doing it or something? Yeah, you got. You have to pick one more card to see. Okay. So the kindergarten class is now a stuffed animal. Oh. <laughs> Hobby kids can be pretty ferocious, and you know. I am in a berserker rage. Oh, oh wow. Can you imagine Forrest Gump being in a berserker rage? Oh, Box man. of chocolates. <laughs> I got a pig. Uh, I'd be hitting ping pong balls all over the place. <laughs> so do we even need to argue? Uh, no, I'm dead. Uh, now it's me and you, Hobby Mom. You're on, dude. Which one do you guys think? Hmm, I'm thinking this one or this one. Why don't we go with that one? This one would be funny. Okay, that's the one I'm gonna pick. Now I'm gonna pick three black. Oh, that's a good one. Maybe that one. I think I'll do that one. Yep. Okay. This is what I've got right here. All right, what, I... what do you have? I am a quarter bear that can match your size. Match my size? Okay. I am a Terminator. Ooh. Ten of them. Whoa! Okay. Um. Well, now we pick one, another one. Uh huh. I always forget that. Oh, he just has a game changer. He what can control machines. <laughs> oh man! But. I have a skunk on a stick, oh, but good. my skunk will stink out a, bear. a polar bear. They'll right. make him leave and skedaddle. That's <laughs> Yeah, but, that's what I'm saying. But, but I can dodge. <laughs> <laughs> you forgot about that, Hobby Mom. You can't dodge, you can't see where it's at. <laughs> well, like, oh, dodge the skunk. <laughs> then I take my stick <laughs> that I have. Poke my eyes out. I'll just, I'll just poke your butt. I'll be like, poke, 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 poke. I can, I'm strong. I can break the stick. Okay, I'll give you that. But uh, they're Terminators, so they've terminated the polar bear before the polar bear can, doesn't even have a chance to go after the machine. We're in Because they have lasers. My, my Terminators have lasers. But where are we? We are in the tropics. How about Antarctica? <laughs> okay, fine. I'll agree with that. Can't control you. 
But I've already squashed you. And squeezed skunk juice in your eyes. Well, well. And then poked you with my stick. I can break a stick! I can grab a stick and then break! I am strong! Okay, fine! I'll give you that. We said that already. <laughs> I'll concede because your stinking card that says you can control machines, like totally was ruined my game, man. Like, I almost went with Wooly Mammoth. I should have went with Wooly Mammoth. Let's do another one, let's do another one. Fine, it's on, it's on. <laughs> so, oh my, are you serious? These are weird, that's a good one. Oh boy, I'm gonna pick that one because I think I'll have more of a chance of fighting. I'm, uh, okay. Blob. A blob? <laughs> the blob. Armed with a bow and unlimited arrows. So how could you be armed if you have no arms? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this gives me an arm. Oh, okay. So I'm an Olympic gymnast covered in spikes. Oh! That's pretty cool. <laughs> so we have to pick another black card. So I'm wearing a suit of armor. <laughs> pretty hilarious, actually. Okay, mine says draw and play two random attributes from the deck and then discard this card after use. Lays exploding eggs. <gasps> while driving a tank. Wow! So I'm a gymnast with spikes who can lay exploding <laughs> eggs and I'm driving a tank. I'm armored! But I'm a tank! I, I shoot arrows. whoop do you do I have a tank. <laughs> I can shoot your tank. I can shoot your tank. It's not gonna penetrate my armored metal tank that's like huge. The destruction button? Yes. Like a blowing up button. No, I have a I have I have a squishing button where it squishes blobs. Basically, you're just a chunk of jello. Wearing armor. But if a knight was wearing armor and he got ran over by a tank, he would not survive. I'm blob. You could squish me and I'll like pop back. <laughs> oh. That's a good one. Like, That's like, a good argument. <laughs> That's true. I'll do 50 cartwheels to dodge your arrows. Because <laughs> I'm a gymnast. Nice. A gymnast. I'm a gymnast. Here's a blob. Just cover up close yourself. Kids. But you, you have spikes on your hands and you can't drive because. <laughs> oh, you're going from that angle, huh? It's on automatic pilot. Oh! What does that mean? It means it drives itself for me. I'll blow it up. How? Well, your tank. Wait, How? You have a tank. I have a tank. Wait, wait. Did I, I can the fish tank where I could go in. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, a tank with like the like. Yes. Oh my God. Like in the army. army. Yeah. It can go. I blob. I could like turn little and then go in there, then like break your stuff. I have an arrow. I can break your stuff. Okay. And then I run out because I'm a gymnast because I can run really fast and do like flips and stuff to escape you. I'm a blob with armor. <laughs> the spikes can't get me with the armor. I'm not a blob, I can never die. How do you know? Well, I don't Maybe know. I'll, I will take my tank over to the acid store and get some acid, like car battery acid or something and <laughs> dump it on the blob. But what if the acid melts you, makes you bubble? And then there's like rising steam from the blobs. Or he ate the morning brew. I go to a restaurant. And eat, <laughs> eat, 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 eat. You get me. Let's say you're you're standing right in front of me. You're the blob. I'm a gymnast with hey, spikes. I, I can. I'll, I'll go to every single restaurant. Every time I get bigger, I can go to more restaurants. And I'll cover the whole earth. <laughs> so you're gonna get everybody, well, including me. But I'm your mom. Well, like in a different planet. Oh, I'm still your mother. It's just a game. It has spikes. And who is a gymnast? 
with it. <laughs> I concede because yeah, you could go to restaurants until you take over the whole world. How am I supposed to get you? If you're the blob, you can get inside of her tank and suffocate. Cool. I would flip out of there because I'm, I do flips. Oh, I do flips because they're a gender. I do cartwheels. <laughs> when I'm you're all... stuck in the tank, you can't flip when you're in the tank. I'd, I'd hop and skip out, man. You can skip out! <laughs> Oh the blob is slow. Do it's like do running do through do a snail. Do do do. Skip to a new. Skip to a new my gymnast. Good job. For more behind the scenes, go to Hobby Hobby Kids Vids. Toodaloo! Parents, subscribe for the world's best shows with learning fun. And don't forget, you can press the little info button in the top right corner to keep the hobby fun going. You don't want to miss another episode, so come on. Press that button now.